Happy Friday, everybody. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com with a four-box random team break of 17-18 Panini Donruss Optic Basketball. This is random team break number eight from jazbeeshobbyland.com. The last third of the case is in the store right now, so check it out. So there's everyone's name right here. All teams are in. Let's randomize each list. Five and a three, eight times. One, two, three, four, five, and a three, six, seven, and eighth and final time. After eight times, we've got Will down to Will. Where, where, where there's a Will, there's a way. Eight times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. After eight times, we've got the Clippers down to the Sixers. And trades are allowed, folks, so give it a go if you want to. All right, Willie got the Clippers and the Warriors, Elvis with the Hornets, Joe with the Jazz, Last Spot Mojo, Ray with the Bulls, Will with the Rockets and Pistons, Moody with the Celtics, Brad with the Thunder, Joe with the Knicks, Elvis, you got the Nets and the Timberwolves. Moody with the Magic. Bruce with the Lakers. Brad with the Nuggets. Uh, Stevens, Moody. Moody, you got the Wizards. You're a wizard, Moody. Brad Barnes with the Grizz. Kaz with the Cavs. Michael Brinson, you got the Heat. Nancy with the Mavs. Andrew K with the Spurs. Davey, you got the Suns. Joe, Raptors, Will, Hawks, Nancy, Kings, Joe, Blazers, Will, Bucks, Moody, Pacers, Joe, Pelicans, and Will with the Philadelphia 76ers. Let's sort by team. Once again, feel free to trade if you would like. And while you guys are thinking about trades, let's figure out which four boxes we're gonna do. One, two, three, four, five, six. And it's gonna be three. We'll do that left side right here and we'll, we will reserve this side for next time. Which will be our last break actually. We don't have any more of this. So this will be random team nine, I believe, yeah. So we'll mark these RT9. Kind of hard to write at that angle. So there you go. So we don't have any more of this after this. So get into it while supplies last. I don't know if I have enough space here. All right. Any trades? Moody has uh, the Wizards, the Pacers, and the Magic for trade. And Chris, um, are we going to get more NT bas or baseball? I hope so. We usually try to get it every time we can. Just keep checking back. JaspiesHobbyland.com. You never know when that appears again. I don't know. I don't know when it appears again. So there's some trade teams offers thrown out there. Any trades, any trades, any trades? Give it a few extra seconds. All right, doesn't look like it. Away we go. Trade window closed. One on card autograph per box, plus a bunch of nice parallels. Good luck, everybody. We should finish off that case tonight, jazbeeshobbyland.com. Things only $16.99 a team. And a chance again to tonight's All Spot Sold promo. And a chance to get monster hits out of here. I think it's worth it. Good luck, everybody. Thank you for getting into this break.
So we got the playoffs kicking, starting again, starting up again tomorrow after a long layoff in between. Yeah, Moody is saying, hey, did you hear that Draymond, he, did he actually do it? He trademarked Hamptons 5? I don't think he's the one that coined it, though. I want to say a journalist up north coined it. But I guess, I guess Draymond's trader, I guess he's going with it, huh? I'm not even quite, I'm not even sure what the, uh, what the context of that, of that, uh, nickname is. I have some trademarking that I need to do moves. I'm gonna get that on board. All aboard. We get expressed. What is he, is he is he gonna I guess what what would he use it for? T shirts? Mugs? Coffee mugs? Wine glasses? Hampton's five winery? Ooh. Could be interesting. All right, box number one. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Nice, Dan Smith Jr. That's not a that's not a hollow, but still uh, still nice. The hollow ones are the ones with the big value. But that goes to the Mavs. That'll be for Nancy. There's Kevin Love, orange, and for the Supersonics, Sean Kemp goes to the Thunder, of course. Lime green. For Brad, out of 175. Nice. Man, Sean Kemp. Remember him? Kevin Love for the Cavs goes to Cause. 20 out of 199. It's just, it's just Kevin Love and LeBron James dragging that team around. Let's see how they do. Jalen Brown playing well. There's Draymond. Trademarking. And the autograph is for the Jazz. Adrian Dantley. That goes to Joe and the Jazz and the Last Bond Mojo. Nice. Hall Dominators. 18 out of 49. 54%. Wow. That's the highest field goal percentage, 54%, of any player 6 foot 5 or shorter in league history. Yeah, you expect that kind of thing from, from big men. All right. Jalen Brown, lime green for the Celtics. Moody with the Celtics. 71 out of 175. There's Frank Tilakina. That's hollow right there. That's for the Knicks. That'll go to Joe Kavanaugh. LaMarcus Aldridge for the Spurs. There's Thomas Bryant, my Lakers. And we've got Jason Tatum, the rookies. That'll be for the Celtics. There's a nice Donovan Mitchell. Not a hollow, but still Donovan Mitchell. Jason Tatum, Celtics. He's playing like a vet, not a rookie. Steven Adams. Bam Adebayo. Zach Randolph, Pink Velocity. Paul Westfall and Rajon Rondo. Box number one in the books. Next box. Good luck. Who does everyone have in game three? Ray and I were talking about this a little bit off camera. I just don't know what side to pick anymore. I'm just not very good at that anymore. Regular season, I was able to pick games just fine. Playoffs are a different animal. It's a lot harder. One thing I do know, though, in case you were intending to put a couple pennies on some of these games, go with the player props, the player proposition bets. I feel like Houston can't or won't stop Kevin Durant. I think they can't. They're also not intending to. I think they're just going to be like, you get yours, Kevin Durant. We'll stop every, try to stop everybody else. It kind of worked in game two. Let's see if that works with them again in game three for the Rockets. But I think Kevin Durant's going to get his. 
Same with the Celtics. I don't. I just don't think they're going to be able to stop LeBron James. And I think LeBron James will just get his. But then who else after that? <laughs> LeBron James can't score 100 points. Or could he? Maybe he could. Maybe he should. Just do it, LeBron. Just say screw it. Have him sc just score 90 points. The Rockets, the Rockets Warriors series, I think, I think is going to be is going to turn out to be a really good one. I can see six or seven games in that. This, the, the Cavs are going to show a lot in Game Three what they're about. You know, if they want to make a series out of this or not. But you know, you watch Game One and Two of the Western Conference Final, you go, okay, those teams look like they could be pretty evenly matched. They could, they could, they could, you know, they could duke it out. They could box it out for for seven rounds, you know, all seven games. Cavs. I don't know. It's not not quite there yet for the Cavs. But they have a small chance, you know. The Celtics have struggled a little bit on the road. As good as they have looked at home, they have not been nearly as sharp on the road. So that could be a factor, something that the Cavs should try to take advantage of. There's Jamal Crawford, there's Jason Tatum, there's Lonzo Ball, and Lonzo Ball! Signature Series? Yes! Nice, for my Lakers. Who's got my Lakers? Bruce with my Lakers. I'm sure Bruce is a huge Lonzo Ball fan. He's a fan of this big hit right here. I feel like he's... He should be better be working hard in the summer, Lonzo. He's got some interesting aspects to his game. But let's see if he continues to grow next season. Jamal Crawford for the Timberwolves. That is for Elvis. 79 out of 199. Ben Simmons. Even some of his second year stuff, Ben Simmons stuff. Can do something on a secondary market. There's Pink Velocity, Andre Iguodala, 37 out of 79 for the Warriors. That goes to Will. Ray says, I'm going to go Celtics and Warriors. That's what it seems like. There's Tyler Dorsey, Hollow. Bill Russell, Red. Kevin Durant, Lime Green. Amir Johnson, Hollow. Kevin Durant, KD, out of 175 for Will Bartle. Bill Russell, big Bill Russell, 16 out of 99 for the Celtics. It's one for uh, Moody and the Celtics. And the Tyler Dorsey hollow goes to Will. Markel Fultz, nice, orange, rated rookie. That's pretty strong right there. That goes to Will and the Sixers. 13 out of 199. It's a nice parallel. I should more than more than easily cover the spot. All right, two more boxes to go. Anyone else have any uh, game predictions? Rays taking Celtics Warriors. What does everyone else think? Six Warriors. My original. I'm gonna stick with my. I don't know, feel. I don't feel as confident about it anymore. But I will go with the original picks that I made before the series started when I placed a couple pennies on series wagers. For entertain. This is all for entertainment purposes only, of course, folks. But now the Su Supreme Court says it's, says it's cool. It's only a matter of time. Um, I'm sticking with Cavs, Cavs Rockets is where I thought it was going to be, which now sounds crazy in my head, but I'll stick with it. Stick with it till the end. No hedging for me. Cavs Rockets. 
What do the Cavs need to do? Well, LeBron's got to have his teammates outside of like LeBron and Kevin Love. You know, LeBron's teammates got to step up. Maybe Tristan Thompson maybe works a little bit. I think they played him a little bit more in game two. I think he offers some, some defense. Uh, played Larry Nance more. You know, at home, maybe he sparks, uh, you know, gets the home crowd going. He's a high-energy guy. I did see something. Uh, I think Tracy McGrady on the jump on ESPN was talking about this, as well as Kobe Bryant in that ESPN Plus show, Kobe Bryant Detail. He was saying that LeBron James in the post was was near unstoppable when he got into the post against the Celtics, but he, every, both Tracy McGrady and Kobe Bryant almost separately were kind of scratching their heads going, why aren't they going to him in the post some more? Which is, he would, in the low post. You know, like, he exerts less energy. He's a big dude. You know? He could, he could walk some guys back. All right. Next box, Damian Lillard. Nancy agrees with Ray. Celtics Warriors, she says. Damian Lillard leads us off. There's Jonathan Isaac. There's Frank Mason the third, pink velocity rated rookie. Actually, we'll save that Kyle Kuzma, even though that wasn't a hollow. Save that Kyle Kuzma as well. The hollow ones definitely are the desirable ones, but just for the hell of it. Champs here, KD, out of 175. That could could be another one for him. Darren Fox, Tony Bradley, Josh Jackson. Let's save at least one of each of those. Tony Bradley for the Jazz. That's an orange parallel. Joe with the out of 199. Darren Fox for the Kings. Goes to Nancy and KD, lime green for Will and the Warriors out of 175. There's Lonzo Ball, the rookies. And your autograph is Ivan Rab, rated rookie autograph. Nice, he's got a kind of a nice loopy auto. I like that. Uh, Brad Barnes with the Memphis Grizzlies. Jason Tatum. Let's see if there's other low number parallels here. Gary Harris. Some lime green coming up, it looks like. That lime, save a Dan Smith Jr. for Nancy. There's Aaron Gordon, Magic. Wes Wundu hollow. As you can tell, the not too many of the hollows that are around. That's why they've got the value. Wes Wundu going to the Magic. That's for Moody. Aaron Gordon, Lime Green, also for you, Moods. 98 out of 175. And just the regular rated rookie of Dan Smith Jr. for Nancy. All right, last box coming up, folks. Good luck, everybody. We've got our final four box of this in the store right now, jazbeeshobbyland.com, so check it out. We don't have any more cases of Donner's Optic basketball, and uh, I'm sure we'll try to get some more. I don't know when we're gonna get more. So I would just grab the spots now while you can. It's a good deal, too, $16.99, low risk, high reward. A lot of fun, e like even basketball is, is, has so much value that even some of the parallels that we've been pulling could probably pay for the spot, if not more. Mike Tower asking, put Kobe or Jordan with LeBron's team, and do they do better, same, or worse? Hmm. <laughs> I mean, you gotta think. You're not talking that like Kobe and Jordan aren't like they're not just all stars. They're not just top ten players. They're like top five players. 
You know what I mean? So you gotta think. I mean, you gotta think. With Kobe or Jordan, they would they would do great. You would want. That's actually a good question. Jordan Jordan is an underrated defender. I think he he comes from an era back in the day where they played tough defense. Uh, so Jordan would provide that defense. Kobe or Jordan with LeBron, I think, would be kind of unstoppable. <laughs> right? I think they I think they would do better. Oh, without LeBron? Oh, oh, oh. I think they would do the same. I think Kobe would get his and Jordan would get his, but they wouldn't win games. Yeah. Oh, I, I see. I get the question now, Mike. So you're saying you're saying if Co minus LeBron, add Kobe or Jordan in place of LeBron. No, I think they do the same. I.e., not very well. Tyler Dorsey, just like that, is your autograph, Rated Rookie Auto. There you go. That's our last auto of this box. We got Zoo Key for the Rockets, hollow. We got Reggie Miller, Retro Series Lime Green. Lime Green for the Pacers. That'll be out of 175 for Moody. And this will go to the Rockets. That'll be for Will. Red Marcus Morris for the Celtics. That'll be for Moody. 61 out of 99. Save that Lori Markin for the Bulls. Save that Markel Fultz as well. Sixers are going to be a scary team next year. There's Thaddeus Young, orange for the Pacers. That'll be another one for Moody, another parallel. 147 out of 199. Any other, anything else low numbered? There is some lime green. Patrick Beverly for the Clippers. Let's give that Ben Simmons too. That'll go to the Sixers for Will. Clippers are also for Will. And the last bit, ladies and gentlemen, pick your, or random team number eight from jazbeeshobbyland.com is in the books. So thank you very much, everybody. We've got the last four boxes just off camera right here on jazbeeshobbyland.com. So check it out, and let's do another break. Thanks very much, everybody. Good excuse for us to talk some hoops. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.